Jeep was at the front of the SUV craze that swept North America back in the 90s. In fact, it seemed like just about every second vehicle on the road was a Jeep Grand Cherokee. But nowadays, the midsize SUV market is actually the most crowded in the auto industry. So when we had a chance to drive the latest Jeep Grand Cherokee back in 2005, we found it a little small on the inside. Jeep decided to keep it the same size. No third row of seats is offered and the load height is high. The interior uses cheap looking plastics that can scratch easily too. We did like the improved on-road ride and the available Hemi power, and of course the off-road capability that Jeep offers. The Jeep Grand Cherokee has received middle-of-the-road marks from J.D. Power & Associates, including average for mechanical quality and average for overall quality and design. Minor problems include noisy air conditioning units and transmission leaks. Our search of used 2005 Grand Cherokees on driving.ca shows that these Jeeps still pull in good money. Asking prices range from around the mid-20s all the way up to the mid-30s for a 2005 model. Even the Canadian Black Book wholesale price for a 2005 base model Grand Cherokee with 60,000 kilometers is around $14,500 to $17,000. The Grand Cherokee was a pioneer in the midsize SUV market, but now it's got competition from all sides with bigger, more powerful and better equipped trucks. But the one thing that Jeep has going for it is its built-in off-road ruggedness that's in every Grand Cherokee. 